What, what's going on right now? I swear to God, I just saw something behind you. Did it just stop scanning on its own? Construction of the Trans-Allegheny Lunatic Asylum was completed in 1881 and it was designed to house 250 patients. In the 1950s, it reached its peak capacity housing 2,400 patients in overcrowded and generally poor conditions. During the time it was open, many patients lost their lives and many others were turned into zombies of their former selves at the hand of ice pick lobotomies performed by Dr. Walter Freeman. Changes in the treatment of mental illness and the physical deterioration of the facility forced its closure in 1994. During this public investigation, we were given two hours on each floor. These two hour windows started with a tour of hotspots. Our group started on the second floor. Dude, here we are. Is there? Trans Allegheny Asylum. Or two. This is the oh, 11 to 17. 11 17. And then. That's right. Right. Hello, Ben. My name is Alex. My name is Murray. We're Let's here to see if you wanted to communicate with us tonight. Is there anything you want to say? Ben, if you are here. We just want to talk to you. I'm going to set this down over by the showers. All you have to do is get close to it. Just like that. And we'll know that you're here. Also, there's also a small little ball on the floor. If you want to roll it, it'll light up. Ben, why were you here?
I swear I saw something. Hmm? I swear I saw something. Watch out. Oh, it surprised me. Ben, are you here? Step back again. Something for a second just blocked like the red light in front of my face. Really? Yeah. Like it just blocked it out of my eyesight for a second. Ben, is that you? Then I'm going to open something and allow you to communicate with us. All you have to do is watch. What you hear? Tapping on the porcelain. Then I'm like. No. Ben or whoever is here, if you can talk into that box I just put on the floor, we'll be able to hear you. I heard it again. Mm -hmm. It was a It's subtle. I don't know what's making that. It's almost like the, like the capo would make that sound. Only go around the ground. Yep. Is that what you heard? Water. That sounded like dripping. Yep. Hear it again? It's a shower. You see this? What? Why didn't it say it? Is your volume up? What? Did you hear that? I keep hearing the... It's like, I don't know. Is it that? No, I hear. I definitely hear it in front of me. Ben, is that you that I'm hearing? What? Dude, again. What? Something is passing in front of that, in front of my face. It's freaking me out, man. Kevin, are you the one making the light go or the light go out when you pass it? Is that what Murray is saying? Or Ben, is that you? Kevin, do you know Ben? I heard a squeak behind me. Behind you? Yeah. Like a mouse. Oh, you know what? What if it is? Somewhere. One of the bats. No, I can't. No, I can't. No, you can't. Speak to us? Or no, you can't make our devices go off. If you're able to make the devices go off, we can ask you yes or no questions.
Mm -hmm. Who just knocked? Kevin or Ben? Was that in here? Okay, we are in Jane's room. Jane, are you in the room with us? Me? Me? Is that me? Yes. Jane, if you are with us and you'd like to speak with us, my name is Murray. Jane, if you're here, can you do us a favor and walk over to that red light in the doorway? A favor and walk. We can. Are you opening yours? Yeah. That's Alex's unhappy face. They, they can't read that. It says we were executed. Why is it not saying it? Is your silent on? Yeah, there you go. We were executed. How did she say Jane died? She hung she, herself. She, well, sort of. Yeah. But the, the, um, but the, uh, like she heard yeah. and to the red light and just kept like yeah. lunging. Witness. Witness. Who Witness. witnessed, Jane? Did someone witness this? Full disclosure, there are other people here with us. So, anytime he makes that face that you just made. Full disclosure, there are other people here with us. So anytime he makes the face that he just made, it's because we're hearing those people and not actual noises. What's up? Did you show me last time? Yes, I did. Okay. I left it on, actually. Okay. Yeah. Don't be zero. 
We're not fearful. Yeah, not at all. We just want to talk to you. We came here for you. Can you say your name? Can you go stand over by that red light on the floor? Are you still here? Her, didn't her husband just dump her here? You're right. And she waited mm -hmm. like three days. Mm -hmm. She said, your family. Oh, it may not always come to me. What? Suicide. suicide. Yes, Jane. We know that you unfortunately committed suicide. And we know that you were very can upset. You, can you tell everyone here Watching how you did it. Can you tell us why he did it? Remember, you can also come over here to this thing and get close to it, and I'll do that. If you can do that, you go over to that red light, we can ask you yes or no questions, and you can just respond by getting close to it. It might be easier than trying to communicate through that box in Alex's hand. We would like to speak with Dean. I 
My name is Murray. My name is Alex. We know that something very bad happened to you here, Dean. There's a red light in the middle of the room. If you walk over to it just like this, it'll let us know that you're here. And we can ask you yes or no questions. And you can answer by going over to it. Don't be afraid, Dean. Was that a bang? Something out here. I promise we're not here to hurt you, Dean. We just want to speak with you. If you can show us that you're here, we can play some games. Would you like that? Airplane mode. I'm going to set this box down on the floor. If you come over to it, you can speak into it and we'll be able to hear your words. Dave and Big Jim, if you're here, give us a sign. Make a noise. Walk over to this red light on the floor. Liar. Who's a liar? Can you tell me who's lying? Can you give me a name? Ooh. What? I think a badger's living in here. My whole body just chilled out. Did it? Yeah. I'm at peace. Who's at peace? Can you tell us your name? Is this Dean? If this is Dean, there's a few different stories of what happened to you. And if you'd like to talk about it, we'd like to listen. Listen up for me. We're listening, Dean. Keep your ears up in the hallway. Yeah. Dean, can you come sit next to me where I put this red light? Promise on the friend. I heard it. What the fuck is that? I'm at peace. 
What you, what's going on over there? What the fuck is that? Like someone walked, walked right up on me. <laughs> you see me back up? Huh? You see me back up? Yeah. I didn't know what you were doing at first. <laughs> Start with me. I've never seen you react like that. I've never seen you react like that. What part? All of it. <laughs> I don't want to go in the hallway. <laughs> like what? Like, I got up to go out there, and I stopped. No, I know. I still don't want to. <laughs> I'm hearing that. Sounds like upstairs to me. It's upstairs? I think so. I don't think there's anyone down here. Hmm? I don't think there's anyone down here. Dude, you were like, you were here, and then you like, you jumped back like this, wait, wait, and wait, it wait. was even more dramatic, it was like, this is because, all right, when I walk, walk up, this is what I felt like. What... I swear to God, I just saw something behind you. The thing just say, be careful? Yeah. I don't like this. I don't like, do, can we go back to the middle? You want to get out here? Yeah, I don't like this. Why? What'd you see? It was over your shoulder. It looked like a face. What? I swear to God. All right, real fast. I'm going to show you what I felt like. Like, stand in the I'm doorway. In between three doorways. Stand in that doorway. Okay. Facing this way. All right. Right? Yeah. You walk up to it, right? Yeah. This is what it felt like. Yeah, I don't like that. Did you really see something? Sorry. You said it was over my shoulder. Of course I'm gonna be like, ugh. Okay, I'm not going down this seclusion hallway. No? No. I'm going out. Oh, don't do that. I'm going out to this one. Oh, what the fuck was that? What? What? The freaking dummy. <laughs> That's not funny. <laughs> Where's the fucking door? Right here. Want to try that one? No. No, I need to uh, swing.
you thought we were not going to fucking be able to get separated from people. There's nobody here. There's no one even close. No. We were at the end of this wing. By ourselves. Nobody was in this whole wing. Oh my god. Does that not give you the heebie-jeebies? <laughs> A little bit. That's terrifying. Oh my god, dude. Where are you then? Alright, spirit box time. What do we have? What is this new uh, doohickey? It's an AMC noise control. Noise control. That's uh... sad. <sighs> How'd that go? Uh, it was a one time deal. <laughs> Set it up here, maybe? I'm gonna set it up here? Or you wanna hold it? What up? Something I couldn't make it out. Were you able to make it out? Mm Help us? The help that sounded like help us. Yes. Is someone asking for help? Can you tell us your name? Is it not even scanning? No. Did it just stop scanning on its own? That was a deep voice. This thing just stopped scanning on its own. What the f was that? Was the volume up that high?
You okay? No. What's wrong? Everything. I'm sorry. Yeah, we know this was your mom. Did you like it here? Can you roll that ball back to us? Seems like you have a lot of fun toys here. The church. The church. Did you go to church? Oh. It just said the church. There's a Bible over right here. <laughs> Did you have Many friends? Many soldiers here. Many soldiers? Were the soldiers your friends? Did the soldiers play games with you? Are you hiding from us? Is this your desk over here next to me? Did you like the color? Obvious. Obvious that that's your desk? I'm going to show you how that toy in the middle of the room works again, okay? All you got to do is get close to it and it lights up different colors. 
If you can show us that you can do that, we can play a game where we ask you questions. Is somebody sitting at the desk? Willie, are you sitting at the desk? Are you coloring? Eric. Eric. Who's Eric? We don't have too much time left here, Lily. We would really appreciate it if you'd talk to us. That's that. Mm -hmm. To all the spirits that have spoken with us tonight, we thank you. We are going to be leaving now, but you have to stay here. You cannot follow us or attach to us. We're going back to our home. This is your home and you have to stay here. But we thank you again for communicating with us and we will be back.